Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to a Roblox horror game called Far From Land. This is apparently a really good horror Roblox game suggested by Cleedy. And whether or not it's actually good or not remains to be seen. Let's go ahead. We'll bob right into the game. I guess we'll play normal mode and we'll see what's cooking. Well, well, welcome to Celadon Logistics. Celadon is a world leader in shipping and handling worldwide with over 280 ships on our fleet. Here at Celadon, we believe in the power of collaboration, innovation, and efficient teamwork. We have over 80,000 hardware and crew members and shipping agents will proudly welcome you to be a thriving force in the logistics industry. So come join us at Celadon, empowering the economy. <laughs> What the fuck is this? Wait. Okay, first of all. All right, Malcolm, this week will be a bit different. Just get the ship running and I'll run you down on the details. Okay, just get the ship running, bitch said. So I gotta... Anyways, we've got some big news from Sell It On themselves. Apparently we have a special delivery this week. I know this month's been really tough for you, but this is pretty important. You remember those robots from that warehouse? Seems like some company has bought them and wants to take them to their facility. The problem is their facility is pretty far from here. Although this will definitely frighten you knowing all the stuff that has happened recently, we are taking huge safety measures with us. First off, you'll be doing this by yourself. The crew members won't be in the ship during voyages, and you'll mostly be in charge of both steering and taking care of the ship. This is all just so we can minimize any danger that comes with delivery, as this is a pretty long journey. Since our regular routine has changed so much, I'll have to reread the instructions on how to handle the ship for you just in case, but I know you obviously know how to handle the ship. I mean, you are the captain, but I've been obligated by staff to do so. So, here we go. In front of you lies the steering wheel. If you hover over the left, middle, or right part of the wheel, you'll be able to move and turn the ship left and right. Right up. Wait, I think I just turned up my... Oh! Great, either you took ages or a few seconds to understand. By the way, you'll most likely meet a lot of obstacles in the way during your voyages. The weather there is hectic, so be sure you're careful driving around and don't end up smashing into icebergs or seagulls. There are a handful of other things in your cockpit. All the screens monitor to certain things. You have a motion detector that scans the whole ship for anything that moves. You have a monitor that keeps track of your distance, and a monitor that keeps track of your water pump and ship integrity. This ship is extremely old, by the way. It'll be decommissioned sometime soon, but it was really the only ship that was available. You'll most likely experience the ship breaking apart from time to time, and stuff tends to malfunction a lot. You're equipped with a ship horn that'll scare any intruders away if they're outside or if there's any incoming obstacles. You also have a water pump lever to your right, which refills your water level if it drains. It seems like the last crew forgot to refill it. Try to use the horn and also refill your water pump by pulling the lever. Okay, so use my horn. Apparently I got a horn integrity meter. Not really certain why the fuck you would ever have some shit for that. Do I just honk? How I honk that some bitch? Oh, oh, it's down on the bottom left. I see. Okay, so I got a mean honk game. I'm supposed to pull the water flow lever. Um... I know you can do it. Okay, that should be all the information you need to learn. If you're behind you, you'll be met with a hall in front of you, and a door on the right, which leads you to the maintenance room. You'll be going to that room a lot, so go in there and I'll explain how it works. Oh my god. Stop. This room is cluttered with pipes and whatnot. Whenever a system breaks or a ship's integrity declines, a pipe will burst here. Speaking of which, I guess the last crew didn't make sure to check this room either. Go ahead and fix that pipe that's currently leaking. The room is pitch black, so use your flashlight to see better. Oh my god! Good job. As I said, if anything breaks, just go in here and repair any pipes to start leaking. Alright, you can go back now. I think that should be everything you can learn. Oh, by the way, you'll be in charge of checking the state of the ship after you've arrived. 
So, once you're finished, you'll have to stay in the current deck you're in and complete a checklist just to make sure the ship's in good order before leaving. Anyway, I'll leave you alone now. I'll see you when you get there. Wait a minute, what the fuck is the, what the fuck is the? Why can you hold your breath right there? What is that, you some bitch? You are not alone. In this ship, a robot will roam at night. If you see him in the hallway, well, control your breath by pressing control before he gets too close. Oh my God. There's no real pause. I can't even talk shit. I don't even got time to talk shit. Okay, so I gotta control a whole bunch of diabolical bullshit. Wait, so am I not moving if my hand's not on the wheel? You're not. You gotta have your hand on the wheel for this thing to be moving forward. Otherwise you stop dead in the water. Now I got a motion sensor on the bottom left-hand corner. I've got the ship integrity, all that bullshit down there. I don't really understand the water pump thing. I'm coming up on a glacier, so I probably should turn. Let me make sure I don't hit that. Okay, wow, so this is a video game, video game. I understand. Now I'm seeing on the motion detector, the bottom, I guess not bottom left, but like kind of center bottom left. There's like a radioactive signal on that right hand side, but otherwise I'm not seeing any motion. What the f huh. Huh. Oh, so these mother me me. Well, I just, I just saw a ping on the radar. Oh, that bitch going further away though, so we ain't tripping. Let's just keep driving, goddammit. Okay, as long as that bitch off in Narnia, we cooking nasty. Oh, so this a goddamn chef and French shack. Okay, so as long as nothing breaks, my ship integrity is at 40%, something about to blow. One of these bitches about to blow. Oh, hell no, this game look kind of diabolical. I'm gonna turn down the volume a little bit. Okay, bitch far left. Let me not hit, let me not hit a bird. Let me not hit a bird. So I guess like, I guess bullshit can, it can like appear in front of you too, cause that's what the horn's for. I guess, I guess like the only thing you'd be horning at would be like other ships, right? Oh damn, they, they just popped the iceberg out of fucking Narnia there. Look at that shit. Okay, so. That bitch, that bitch, that bitch coming straight up the middle. Now, wait a minute, shouldn't I see that bitch out by windshield or is he? Ah! I'm literally holding my shit. I'm about to pass out, you little fucking verge. Uh, hang in there, Malcolm. You're about halfway there, so stay alive for a little bit longer. Oh my god! That bitch had on a toupee! And that bitch had it styled like locks! Bro, that's insane! That bitch had on a lock toupee! I didn't even know that was a thing, motherfuckers! Oh, wow! Oh, wow! Oh, wow! Oh, so this game dead ass for serious. I'm at 900 out of 1400. Okay, so this could. What's that? Oh. There's a malfunction. Fix that shit, fix that shit, fix that shit! Oh, so I didn't realize the lights come on like that. What is this? I don't. Can you hold your breath infinitely? It seems like you can, maybe. I'm speculating, but it seems like you can hold your breath forever. I could look at this bitch's hair, dude, though. Y'all gotta look up close. Y'all gotta look at that shit up close. Okay. Now I will say, there's a good thing about the fact that that bitch clearly has not been WD-40 since the beginning of time, because that bitch make a lot of noise when he pull up on your ass. Okay, so let's cook. We, we about to hit 1400. I think I heard that bitch, am I tripping? He come back pretty quick. Oh wait, that bitch not playing no games. Wait a minute. Hold tight. 
Hold tight. I got a ping. I got a ping. I, I, I'm a. Okay, he's straight middle. But he ain't close middle. He's straight middle. So is is this map behind me? Like I don't really understand how this how this map is laid out. To be honest, I thought it was in front of me, but that can't be right because I go backwards and then I see him. I got no fucking clue. I'm hoping this bitch don't terminate my dumb ass. He ain't pinged on the radar in a minute. How could that be? I'm really getting greedy with this. I, maybe I shouldn't do this. Okay, I got greedy. But now they talk about a checklist or some shit. So that was only night one, huh? Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. That was only night number one, huh? Okay, well, there's definitely going to be more enemies that pop up in this game later on. There's that whole left-hand door that we haven't done nothing with. What is it, like, say, crew cabins or some shit? It says something like that. All right, the ship is successfully docked Stop. and the crew is finishing their shift. First voyage isn't that awful, eh? Anyways, you'll now have to complete the ship safety checklist. Mm. Don't worry, it shouldn't be too hard. Mm. The checklist will include all of the tasks you need to complete before leaving. If you're confused as to what to do, the checklist includes a guide just in case. It gets pretty dark in there, though, so make sure you aren't wandering in the dark all the time. See you tomorrow. Is this guy fucking serious? Your shift is not over yet. Before you leave the ship, you must complete a safety checklist. All of your tasks are listed on your checklist along with a guide. Be careful. A monster is lurking in the upper deck. If you hear breathing, hold your breath with shift. Do not turn on your flashlight or walk until the breathing goes away. If you don't hear breathing, use control to use your flashlight. Oh my. Oh my God. Fix pipes. Collect jerry cans, replace generator fuse, disable the power. Lights on. I'm supposed to be fixing a pipe? Shh. Shh. I don't hear breathing. Okay, now wait a minute. Okay, now wait a minute. I didn't hear that bitch. I didn't hear him. Did y'all hear him? Maybe I had my flashlight off for too long. It does say you gotta have your light on if you don't hear the breathing. All right, the ship is successfully docked and the crew is finishing their shift. Maybe that was why I died. Can you go in here? Oh, you can. Oh my God. I should have done that first pipe. I'm throwing it. I didn't think that door opened, I'm not gonna lie. Let me cook. Let me cook. Shh. Shh. Oh, look at the map to the top. Let's go, sir. I don't hear breathing. The fuck is that? Oh my god, you twat. Oh my god, you twat. Oh. Shh. Move. Shh. Enter. Listen. Clear. Clear. Move. Breathing. Clear. Whew, that could 
something bad? Clear. There's a jerry can. I need that. Oh my god. That splishy splash, we're clear. I'm supposed to be finding how many jerry cans? These motherfuckers me me. I, I I searched the whole map. Wait, I didn't I only saw one. Am I a fucking idiot? Did you all hula hand gamer see one? I see one there. Let me cook. Let me cook. That's okay. That's not like music. Was there one in here? Where is it? This kid kind of got my blood pressure up. What is that? I don't give a f- SHUT UP! He's gonna get me killed. I should have turned that on last. That was stupid for me. I can't hear. I'm gonna die. Okay, gamers. Oh my fucking god. Okay, turning turn, 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 turn on. Turning on that generator was a big mistake for me. Turning on that generator was a big ass mistake for my dumb ass. Oh yeah, you gotta do that last. You gotta do that last. That bitch could've been that could bitch could've been breathing on your goddamn giblies and you wouldn't have even known it. Oh wow. Malcolm? Oh god. Glad to hear still in one piece. So don't take notice of what happened yesterday and they said there's some improvements on the ship. And they wanted me to tell you about it. Don't worry about the last ship, we're all still good because not one of the robots are going to escape. We're forced to add a few extra security measures to the ship so it doesn't happen again. Anyways, we managed to install a shower handle at the back hall for the left door. If you go back and check the door, you'll see a yellow handle. We figured that if any of them escape their container again, you can use the handle to temporarily damage the ship. We don't really know if this will cause any permanent damage to the robots, which would lead to a uh, lawsuit, but it was the cheapest solution we could find. If any of them are outside the door, pull the handle and it will release water on them, which should hopefully scare them off. Be careful with how long you use the shower handle as it will drain the amount of water you have left. If that happens, you can refill your water with the lever in your cockpit to the right. That's where the water levels Just for. keep track of your motion detector if any new ones happen to escape the ship. And you should be good. I'll let you know if we've done anything else to your ship. Good luck. Okay. Another new robot will roam the ship this voyage, and it will take a different path to you. He cannot be seen, but you'll hear him when he's outside. Use the motion detector to track his movement. You have been equipped with an emergency shower. Use it once he's outside the door. Okay, get this off my screen, please. I can't see him, it says. It's just I can't see him. That bitch is that bitch is living in the darkness. Why ain't I getting no pings on the radar? Ship integrity about to blow. Fuck. Might have been stupid. I don't know. Malcolm, there's someone outside the door. Quick, use the shower. I used all the water before. I think I'm fucked. I think I'm fucked. Oh! Let me go. Ow! Got him. You'll be 
able to see anyone outside that pitch black hole. So use your motion detector. Before the guy pulled up, kind of fucking insane that that happened to me. So which ping is it on the motion detector? Is it the right one or the left or the top or the bottom? I don't understand if that map is behind me or in front of me. I can't tell. That's close. Wasn't that right here? That was really close. I don't know how much my ship's about to blow. My ship's integrity 1%. This game's fucking insane. Clear. Fix that ass, fix that ass, fix that ass! Ah! Look, is that? Is that over here? Amos, I'm not certain. Now it is. <laughs> Little big eyed fuck! Cook this big-headed ass. Cook this big-headed ass. Kind of look like little Nikki. I'm not gonna lie. Wait, relax. Okay, we're clear. Good. Okay, here we go. Move. Okay. Hold up. He's going further away. I think. On my left, too. On my left, too. I'm dead. He, okay, okay. Water was easier, too. This thing is too long! Hurry up, Toupee! Why they name that bitch? Why they give that mother a name Marquise? Marcus this cock! Bo, Marcus will enter the left door at the back of the hall before attacking you. You will hear him running towards the door. When he is outside, you won't be able to see him. Use your motion detector to track him and use the shower handle to stop him when he's outside the door. Okay, well, what about the scenario? What about the scenario where f boy McGee sitting there spectating me? This mother f Bo, they double team my ass. Those bitches conniving. Those bitches conniving on my ass! But, hey, yo, Loki. That game kinda hot! Hey, yo, I gotta give Clink credit. Okay, and I don't do it very often, because usually it's not due. But under this particular circumstance, Clee kinda went off. And we are gonna call episode one of what the fuck is this game called? Far from land, right here. We hope that y'all enjoy this Roblox gameplay, and we will be back with another episode. But I have a St. Patty's party to be attending. We are recording this live on djndom.com on St. Patrick's Day, and I gotta go cook, okay? I gotta go cook. So we gotta get off of this bench. But we hope you all enjoyed the episode. Come watch the next live stream. That's djndom.com located right here down below. Come watch. Come hang out with the people and I live. We gotta go. Goodbye!